Are you ready for the biggest hardware upgrade you can make to your Meta Quest 2? In this video, we'll be discussing how connecting a USB-C hub can take your VR experience to the next level, transforming your Meta Quest 2 into a Mega Quest 2X. First, let's talk about the specifications of the Quest 2's USB-C port. The Quest 2 uses USB 3.1 Gen 1, which allows for data transfer speeds of up to 5 gigabytes per second. The port is most commonly used for charging the headset, as well as connecting the headset to a computer for transferring files and playing PC VR titles. It is important to note that the USB-C port on the Meta Quest 2 is not designed to deliver power to peripherals or to be used for display output. However, this port can be used for connecting external devices such as controllers and other peripherals to massively expand your headset's capabilities. Now, let's talk about what you can do with the USB-C hub. One of the biggest benefits is the ability to connect peripheral devices like keyboards, mice, gamepads, and even cameras and video capture devices. This can greatly enhance your VR experience by providing you with additional input options and much more. For example, a keyboard can make it easier to type and enter text in VR and a mouse can provide more precise control. A gamepad can give you a more traditional gaming experience. And a camera can be useful for viewing the outside world in color with your headset still on. You can even use a capture card to view video from other devices like Android TV boxes, gaming consoles, and PCs via HDMI. This can be a great way to bring content from other devices into your VR experience on a giant, resizable screen you can view anywhere. Another great use for a USB-C hub is adding and accessing external storage options on the headset. You can use external hard drives or thumb drives to store media and files, and even use them as system storage if you wish. It is important to note that many USB-C hubs come with power pass-through, which means they can charge all of the connected devices, including the headset, while you're using them. This can be a lifesaver if you're using the headset for long periods of time and don't want to run out of power. A mini keyboard with a trackpad is often an excellent addition to your VR headset, making it easier to type and control a cursor in 2D applications and browser windows. The On Ultra HD streaming device is a lightweight and inexpensive Android TV box which features 4K video output, Google Assistant, Chromecast built in and uses very little power. Paired with a USB capture device, this Android PC is a perfect addition to your Mega Quest 2X. And this 360 Rise 360 Penguin camera works as a USB webcam with the Quest 2 and a USB camera viewing application like Next Camera, allowing you to view and record 360 degree VR video of the outside world directly in your headset. These options are just the tip of the iceberg in terms of the kinds of devices you can connect to your Quest 2 headset with the addition of a USB-C hub. In conclusion, connecting a USB-C hub to your Oculus Quest 2 is a simple and affordable way to greatly enhance your VR experience with the ability to connect peripheral devices, add external storage, and even charge your devices while you're using them. A USB-C hub is a must-have for any Quest 2 owner. Thanks for watching and happy VRing. Hey guys, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. As you might have noted, I used um, ChatGPT to write a, the largest portion of that video. Um, and I used uh, some MetaHumans um, from another website to uh, talk to you guys about the various things you can do with uh, a USB-C hub connected to your headset. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. It was a lot of fun making it this morning. Um, this automated video process is not quite as automated as it seems. It takes quite a lot of, of work. Um, I hope you guys have enjoyed it though. Uh, be sure to like, subscribe, and share this stuff, guys. Get it out there. All right, have a great day. Bye.